Do you want to learn how to potty train your golden retriever fast? Cleaning up pee several times per day is one of the most frustrating things about owning a new puppy. And if your puppy is peeing in the house a lot, it can feel like they're never going to learn how to go outside. In this video of potty training your golden retriever, you'll learn step by step how to teach them to go outside in just a few short weeks. Before we move on with this video, you need to grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him, her. Link to the free, secret training technique guide is in the description below. Step 1, Take them outside often. Some people recommend taking your puppy outside every 20 minutes, while others recommend every hour. The point is, take your puppy outside often, before they need to go. Puppies can hold their bladder for about an hour per their age in months, so a two-month-old puppy can hold it for about two hours. A three-month-old puppy can hold it for about three hours, and so on. However, every accident inside takes your potty training a step back. And if you want to potty train your puppy quickly it's best to never let them have the opportunity to go inside, so it's best to stay a step ahead. If you take your puppy out every 20 minutes and they don't go, then you can bump it to every 30 minutes. But if you take your puppy out every hour and they're having some accidents here and there, then you might want to try every half hour. If you work from home, or you're just hanging out at the house on a Sunday, it might help to set a timer to remind you to take your puppy out. And when you take them outside, remember that it's not playtime. Puppies have short attention spans so they might go outside thinking they need to potty. But when they start playing, and golden retriever puppies love to play, they'll forget about having to go. Then after 10 minutes when they still haven't gone, you take them inside. But now that playtime is over they suddenly remember they have to pee and this nice carpet looks like the perfect spot. And here's another tip that worked for us. Step 2, take them to the same spot. Dogs like to go potty where they smell other pee and poop. You can use this to your advantage by taking them to the same spot every time. However, this works to your disadvantage if you don't clean up accidents correctly. Dogs have much better noses than us and even if we can't smell pee in the carpet, they can, and they'll repeatedly go in the same area. To stop this, you need to clean up accidents with an enzymatic cleaner, not regular soap and water. This type of cleaner breaks down and actually removes the smell so that it's not there anymore. Step 3, Praise them for going outside. When your puppy first comes to your house, they're not going to know where to go potty. But when they go outside and you throw a praise party for them and give them treats, it won't take them long to realize exactly where they should be going. One issue that many people make is praising them too loud and too soon, and interrupting them. One time, when we were really sick of cleaning up accidents, Oliver was going potty outside and we were so happy we shouted, good boy. We startled him and he immediately stopped midstream and jumped up wondering what was going on. So when they go outside where they're supposed to go, calmly praise them as they're going, and when they're done you can really let them know they did a great job. Step 4, Keep them constrained. Clearly the consequences of letting your puppy roam around the house unsupervised can be very serious, so don't take it lightly. Crate training is great for puppies because they usually don't like to go potty where they sleep. When you're not playing with or watching them, put them in a crate where they're likely to not go potty. Then when you take them out of the crate, take them straight outside and praise them for going there. Step 5, Handle Accidents Properly. Accidents will definitely happen when you're potty training your golden, but it's important to handle them properly. First off, don't punish your puppy for going inside or swat them or shove their nose in it. They have no idea what you're trying to tell them or what they did wrong, plus it could hurt your relationship with them going forward, and it's just mean. If you catch them in the act, now is the time to startle them by saying, not in here, or something along those lines. Then grab them and bring them outside to their spot and if they finish going, praise them like normal for going outside. The last step about handling accidents well is cleaning it up with an enzymatic cleaner to make sure they don't think that's their new potty spot. How long does it take to potty train a golden retriever puppy? So if you do all of the steps above, how long should it take for your puppy to be potty trained? 
All puppies are different, but it can take two weeks to a few months for your golden retriever puppy to be potty trained. Potty training mistakes. Potty training is a big learning time for both you and your puppy. It can be a long and frustrating process, but if you don't make these common mistakes, it will be a lot easier and stress-free. Here are the common mistakes new puppy owners make when it comes to potty training. Punishing their puppy for going inside. Not taking their puppy outside often enough. Not praising them for going where they're supposed to. Not recognizing the signs that their puppy needs to go. Not using an enzymatic cleaner. Trying to push their puppy's bladder's limits. Potty training fast facts and tips. We've already covered most of the facts and tips you need to know about potty training, but to summarize things, here's what you really need to know. It can take two weeks to several months to potty train your golden retriever puppy. Golden retrievers are large breeds, so they should pick up potty training quicker than small breeds. Puppies can usually hold their bladders for about one hour per their age in months. Expect to wake up several times per night to take them out. Use the NOAA strategy, don't push their limits, and take them out before they need to go. Always clean up accidents with an enzymatic cleaner. Never punish your puppy for having an accident. If you catch them in the act, interrupt them, take them outside, and praise them for finishing. Praise them for going where they're supposed to go. Take them to the same spot every time. Learn the signs your puppy gives when they need to go. Some puppies may prefer grass over other substrates. Crate training helps with potty training. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the Secret Training Technique Guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the Little Paws Training channel if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.